Hello everyone. I welcome you all in the session of online teaching and learning of English language. I'm Kavita Sabrawal, working as English mistress at Garmen Senior Secondary School for Boys, Raho in SBS Nagar. Dear students, if you remember my previous interaction with you, we were doing a topic of grammar. We were doing direct, indirect speech. ਤੇ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਉਮੀਦ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਪਿਛਲਾ ਪਾਰਟ ਜ਼ਰੂਰ ਯਾਦ ਹੋਵੇਗਾ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਅਸੀਂ ਉਸ ਵਿੱਚ ਕਈ ਐਕਸਰਸਾਈਜ਼ਸ ਕੀਤੀਆਂ ਸਨ ਬੱਚਿਓ ਅੱਜ ਅਸੀਂ ਨਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਬਾਰੇ ਕੁਝ ਹੋਰ ਨਵੀਆਂ ਗੱਲਾਂ ਸਿੱਖਾਂਗੇ ਪਰ ਉਸ ਤੋਂ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਆਓ ਪਿਛਲੇ ਕੰਮ ਦੀ ਦੁਹਰਾਈ ਕਰ ਲਈਏ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਕੀਪ ਯੋਰ ਪੈਨਸ and notebooks handy let us solve this exercise the question is change the narration of the following sentences dear students you have to change from direct speech to indirect speech so let's start change the narration of the following sentences first he said i will be coming home second she said to me you managed this very nicely third bimla said to me manju wrote a poem yesterday fourth the milkman said i did not sell adulterated milk fifth Ram said I will write a book So dear students I hope that you have completed let us move to the next slide and check our answers here I have got the answers please check first he said that he would be coming home the following week second she told me that i had managed that very nicely dear students please check your answers very carefully third bimla told him that manju could write a poem fourth the milkman said that he had not sold adulterated milk and the fifth answer is ram said that he would write a book very good students aao hun agge vadiye let us analyze the following sentences aao pehle assertive sentences padhiye te samjhiye ਸਭ ਤੋਂ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਆਪਾਂ ਅਸਰਟਿਵ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸਸ ਨੂੰ ਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਸਪੀਚ ਤੋਂ ਇਨਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਸਪੀਚ ਵਿੱਚ ਬਦਲਾਂਗੇ ਫਰਸਟ ਹੀ ਸੈਡ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਟੀਚਰ ਆਈ ਹੈਵ ਰੀਡ ਦਾ ਸਟੋਰੀ ਹੀ ਟੋਲਡ ਦਾ ਟੀਚਰ ਦੈਟ ਹੀ ਹੈਡ ਰੀਡ ਦਾ ਸਟੋਰੀ ਤੇ ਬੱਚਿਓ ਦੂਸਰਾ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਹੈ ਸਾਡੇ ਕੋਲ ਸ਼ੀ ਸੈਡ ਟੂ ਮੀ I live in a small house. She told me that she lived in a small house. A son assertive sentences. Te bachiyo hun wari hai interrogative sentences di. Aao ehna nu direct speech to indirect speech vich badalye. The teacher said to him, "Have you read the story?" The teacher asked him if he had read the story. He said to me, "Where do you live?" He asked me where I lived. Let's move to the next slide. Bachcho aao sikhiye ki jadon assi 
ਇੰਟਰੋਗੇਟਿਵ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸਸ ਨੂੰ ਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਤੋਂ ਇਨਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਸਪੀਚ ਵਿੱਚ ਬਦਲਣਾ ਹੈ ਤਾਂ ਕਿਹੜੇ ਨਿਯਮਾਂ ਦੀ ਪਾਲਣਾ ਕਰਨੀ ਹੈ ਰੂਲਸ ਟੂ ਚੇਂਜ ਦ ਇੰਟਰੋਗੇਟਿਵ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸਸ ਇਨਟੂ ਦ ਇਨਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਸਪੀਚ ਡੇ ਸਟੂਡੈਂਟਸ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਕੀਪ ਇਨ ਮਾਈਂਡ ਦੈਟ ਫਰਸਟ ਦ ਰਿਪੋਰਟਿੰਗ ਵਰਬ ਸੈਡ ਇਜ਼ ਚੇਂਜਡ ਇਨਟੂ ਆਸਕਡ ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਦ ਇੰਟਰੋਗੇਟਿਵ ਫਾਰਮ ਇਜ਼ ਚੇਂਜਡ ਇਨਟੂ ਦ ਅਸਰਟਿਵ ਫਾਰਮ ਨੈਕਸਟ ਦ ਕੰਜੰਕਸ਼ਨ ਇਫ ਔਰ ਵੈਦਰ is used if the sentence begins with the helping verb for example do does did is am are will shall can could etc and fourth no conjunction is used if the interrogative sentence begins with wh question word for example what when why where who which how etc au agave diye now let us practice i have got a few interrogative sentences for you enanu डायरेक्ट तो इनडायरेक्ट स्पीच विच बदलना है प्लीज स्टार्ट डूइंग इन योर नोटबुक्स कीप इन माइंड द रूल्स दैट वी हैव डन इन द प्रीवियस स्लाइड लेट्स स्टार्ट फर्स्ट द डॉक्टर सेड टू मी व्हाट इज माय प्रॉब्लम सेकंड ही सेड टू हर How old are you? Third, my father said to me, Where will you go? She said to her cook, Have you prepared the dinner? Fifth, the teacher said to the students, Are you ready for the test? So students, I hope you have completed Let us check our answers. Bachcho pehla sentence hai The doctor said to me what is your problem? Is sentence hai direct speech which te is nu assi indirect speech which badlan ja rahe ha. The doctor asked me what my problem was. Second He said to her, "How old are you?" He asked her how old she was. Bachcho mainu ummeed hai ki tusi apne answer naal naal check kar rahe ho. Third, my father said to me, "Where will you go?" My father asked me where I would go. Fourth, She said to her cook, "Have you prepared the dinner?" She asked her cook whether he had prepared the dinner. The teacher said to the students, "Are you ready for the test?" The teacher asked the students if they were ready for the test. Ao agge vadiye Here I have got some more sentences for you. Ao ena nu direct to indirect speech which badaliye. Sixth, why are you so sad today? She said to Rani. Next, I said to him, "Will you return tomorrow?" Next, he says to me, "Can you help me?" She said to the porter, When will the next train arrive? The teacher said to him, "Why did you not do your homework?" Aao bachcho, dekhe ki ena de answers ki hone chahiye han. Sixth, 
Why are you so sad today? She said to Rani. She asked Rani why she was so sad that day. I said to him, Will you return tomorrow? I asked him if he would return the next day. Eighth, he says to me, Can you help me? He asks me if I can help him. Next, she said to the porter, When will the next train arrive? She asked the porter when the next train would arrive. Tenth, the teacher said to him, Why did you not do your homework? The teacher asked him why he had not done his homework. Let us move to the next slide. Bachyo hun vaddeha imperative sentences one. Let us learn changing of imperative sentences from the direct speech into the indirect speech. Ao kuj examples padhiye te samjhandi koshish kariye. First, the old man said to me, Please help me. The old man requested me to help him. Second, the principal said to the peon, Shut the door. The principal ordered the peon to shut the door. My father said to me, Do not waste your time. My father advised me not to waste my time. Fourth, the commander said to the soldiers, Attack the enemy. The commander commanded the soldiers to attack the enemy. He said to us, Let us play together. He proposed to us that we should play together. Ao agevadye. Students, here I have got the rules to change the imperative sentences into the indirect speech. First, the reporting verb said is changed into ordered, advised, requested, commanded, or asked. Second, the imperative form is changed into infinitive form by placing to before the verb. Third, in case the reported speech begins with let's, the reporting verb said or said to is changed into proposed or proposed to or suggested or suggested to. The conjunction that is used before the sentence beginning with we should or they should. But you in our rules no dimag which rak de hoye ao kuch wakandi practice kariye. Here I have got an exercise for you. Please do it. Write the answers in your notebooks. First, he said to his servant, Go to the railway station. Second, she said to her sister, Take exercise regularly. Raju said to me, Please give me your pen. But you, please apne answers nal nal likh de raho. Fourth, the captain said to his soldiers, March forward. My mother said to me, Let's sit in the sun. So I hope you have completed. Let us move forward. Here I have got the answers. Let us check. First, he said to his servant, Go to the railway station. 
he ordered his servant to go to the railway station second he said to her sister take exercise regularly he advised her sister to take exercise regularly third raju said to me please give me your pen raju requested me to give him my pen fourth the captain said to his soldiers march forward the captain commanded his soldiers to march forward and the fifth one is my mother said to me let's sit in the sun my mother suggested to me that we should sit in the sun students menu ummeed hai ki tusi bahut dhyan de naal apne answers check kar rahe honge let's move forward now i have got some more sentences for you please do write the answers these are also imperative sentences sixth i said to him do not laugh at the poor beggar the teacher said to the boys do not make a noise i said to him please be quiet the hare said to the tortoise let us run a race i said to him don't smoke aao bachcho dekhiye ki na the answers ki honge i said to him do not laugh at the poor beggar or is nu asi indirect speech vich kujh is tarah likh sakde ha i advised him not to laugh at the poor beggar next the teacher said to the boys do not make a noise the teacher ordered the boys not to make a noise i said to him please be quiet i requested him to be quiet the hare said to the tortoise let us run a race the hare proposed to the tortoise that they should run a race tenth i said to him don't smoke i asked him not to smoke let us move forward dear students practice makes a man perfect isli aao kuch hor practice kariye ditte gaye vaka nu direct to indirect speech vich badalna hai aao shuru kariye change the narration of the following sentences first she said to her friend will you help me second i said to my brother i was washing the car yesterday asha said to sudha let us solve these sums the painter said i have white washed the wall ram said to me please take me to a doctor aao bachcho dekhiye ki in are the answers ki honge dear students you all are doing very good today the answers are first she asked her friend if she would help her second i told my brother that i had been washing my car the previous day third asha suggested to sudha that they should solve those sums the painter said i have white washed the wall the bachcho is the answer hovega the painter said that he had white washed the wall or fifth sentence the answer hovega ram requested me to take him to a doctor बच्चे उसी क्वेश्चन नो अगे वाद हुए साडे को छेवा वाक है ही सैट टू मी यू कुड हैव विन द मैच 
The old man said to me, respect your parents. Bacho, is sari vaak, direct speech de vich han, asi ehna nu, indirect speech de vich badalna hai. Eighth, the teacher said to him, did you steal the pen? Ninth, he says, Seema likes fruits. Tenth, she said, I have my own choice. The bachyo ao dekhe ki ena de answers ki honge. Sixth, he said to me, you could have won the match. He told me that I could have won the match. The old man said to him, respect your parents. The old man advised him to respect his parents. The teacher said to him, did you steal the pen? The teacher asked him whether he had stolen the pen. He says, Seema likes fruits. He says that Seema likes fruits. She said, I have my own choice. She said that she had her own choice. Very good students. You all are working very hard today. The Sade Kol 11th sentence hai. He said, 2 and 2 make 4. Do you like this poem? He said to his sister. She said to her friend, Marry him and be happy in life. Mohan said to me, I may not come tomorrow. My mother said, When did you arrive? Te bachyo, Tuhanu hun pata lag gya hove ga ki ehna vaakka nu asi direct speech the sentences aakh de haan. Te ao, ehna nu hun indirect speech which convert kariye. He said, Two and two make four. He said that two and two make four. Do you like this poem? He said to his sister. He asked his sister if she liked that poem. The bachyo saade kol agla vaak hai. She said to her friend, marry him and be happy in life. She advised her friend to marry him and be happy in life. Agla vaak hai bachyo. Mohan said to me, I may not come tomorrow. Mohan told me that he might not come the next day. The 15th sentence hai. My mother said, When did you arrive? My mother Asked when I had arrived. Let us move forward. Dear students, I have got home assignment for you. Please note it down. Change the narration of the following sentences. He said to me, Let us go for a movie tonight. Second, she said, I am not feeling well today. Third, she said to her mother, May I go out with my friends? Fourth, the teacher said to him, Why did you write this letter? Fifth, I said to the policeman, Please help my brother. Sixth, my sister said, I have worked in this company for two years. Seventh, the officer said to me, Why do you want to join the army? Eighth sentence, Abachyo. You said to Alicia, I shall meet you tomorrow. Ninth, what have you done, my son? She asked. The tenth sentence, hai. He said to his wife, Bring me a cup of tea. So, bachyo, 
ਇਹ ਸਾਰੇ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਸਪੀਚ ਵਿੱਚ ਹਨ ਤੇ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਇਨਡਾਇਰੈਕਟ ਸਪੀਚ ਵਿੱਚ ਚੇਂਜ ਕਰਨਾ ਹੈ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਨੋਟ ਇਟ ਡਾਊਨ ਇਨ ਯੋਰ ਨੋਟਬੁਕਸ ਹੀ ਸੈਡ ਟੂ ਮੀ ਲੈਟ ਅਸ ਗੋ ਫॉर ਅ ਮੂਵੀ ਟੂਨਾਈਟ ਸ਼ੀ ਸੈਡ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਨਾਟ ਫੀਲਿੰਗ ਵੈਲ ਟੂਡੇ ਸ਼ੀ ਸੈਡ ਟੂ ਹਰ ਮਦਰ may i go out with my friends the teacher said to him why did you write this letter i said to the policeman please help my brother my sister said i have worked in this company for 2 years the officer said to me why do you want to join the army Next you said to Alicia I shall meet you tomorrow What have you done my son she asked He said to his wife Bring me a cup of tea So bachcho mainu ummeed hai ki tusi apna homework utar liya hovega Dear students you have worked very hard today and now it's time to say goodbye here finishes the second session of narration today we have done direct indirect speech related to assertive interrogative and imperative sentences in the next session we will learn something more about the narration till then goodbye